guys. Oh, okay. Now I just like forgot much of it. Oh man. Oh, here we go. You're amazing. Wait, hold up. You should never give up on your daydream. Hey guys, my name is Queen Cassie. Welcome back to my channel. As I tell everybody, you're a king, you're a queen, you're part of the royal court, and please don't be an asshole. So today we're gonna do this thing called whiskey in a teacup. What is whiskey in a teacup? Uh, it's whiskey in a teacup. Duh. No, uh, it is not your normal dose of tea. So we're just gonna kind of go over some brief cliff notes as to what is going on today in the world and all that jazzy stuff. I'm not sure if you know or not. We actually have three hurricanes that we've been watching right, right now. The one that is going through. Florida, which is Hurricane Irma. Thoughts and prayers with everybody. Hurricane Jose, which looks like it's going to be staying out in the ocean. And then we have Hurricane Katia, which did not make it to the U.S. and stopped in Mexico. So those are going on right now. Our thoughts and prayers are with everybody going through the flood, as well as the survivors of Hurricane Harvey down in Texas. And I really hope that you're doing well. I know you guys will come out ahead. Uh, next, what I wanted to talk about, Netflix. Oh my gosh, I love Netflix and chilling, especially uh, I'm really good at multitasking and I know how to edit my videos and listen to them. So I love being able to sit back, watch some Netflix as well as edit my videos. The three videos I just watched on Netflix that I really liked were, one was Reality High, uh, which was a very good movie. I did enjoy that. The one I watched here recently was Death Note. It was it wasn't super scary creepy, but it, it was good creepy, and I really did enjoy that. And then third, the one that I really did enjoy more than I thought I would, and that might be very well because this Mr. Reeves is in that movie, uh, is To the Bone. And um, all three great movies right now on Netflix, I highly recommend that you go ahead and check them out. Uh, Reality High is definitely a chick flick and a date night movie. Cuddle up with your loved one. Remember the fun times in high school. Grab a bag of popcorn and enjoy this movie. Dark Note could also be a cute little date one for those of you who do not like super scary films. This one's got a couple of scary parts in it. It's not, it's not like, oh my gosh, stop, turn on the lights. I watch this movie in the dark. I love scary movies, but I can't watch them in the dark. I did watch this one in the dark. Um, it was interesting and different, and uh, there was a love scene, some love going on in there, and uh, definitely heartbreaking on how it ended. Um, but one thing I did like about the Death Note is uh, I almost didn't see the end coming. So that was actually kind of nice. I am i don't know about you, but I can easily predict the end of a movie. I mean, we all kind of can if you really think about it. The way that the death note ended, there was a couple of catches in there. I was like, oh, you you got that by me just barely. So, good job, Netflix. Uh, really proud of you for that. I did enjoy it. And To the Bone was uh, definitely interesting, a very moving, a little emotional for anybody who's ever struggled with weight problems and counting calories and going on diets that really are hard for your body and that you shouldn't be going on. You might find this, this, um, serious, not serious, but this, uh, movie, uh, moving and interesting and it really kind of made me take a step back too just on how we critique our bodies so uh that was very very interesting to watch i did like it and again i think that a big part of the reason i watched it was about five and a half minutes into it maybe 10 maybe more i don't know found out keanu reese is in it keanu reese is one of my favorite actors that are out there i think that he is a phenomenal actor and um i really did enjoy the movie the whole cast was amazing and great job guys so that's it with Netflix. Uh, we'll get more into some other things, other shows. We're just going to stick with three for right now. Uh, update here um, in the Cedar Rapids, Iowa district area. <laughs> um, that will be next week. We're going. I'm going to be doing a little fun around town update um, as far as things that are going on and uh, events and stuff that are coming up. Super excited about. I know there is an event Wednesday at Ramsey's and Marion for the Hooks. Right, as in writing, night. Wednesday at Ramsey's Wine Bistro in Marion. It's at 1127th Avenue. Uh, Wednesday the 13th at 7 and 9. Uh, the host for the evening is Hook Founder. I don't even know how to pronounce your name. I don't want to botch it. It's A-K-W-I-N-J-I. -I. She'll share details about the upcoming calls for submissions for Art Loud. Stories of Tug and War. Have a seat and write with us on the second Wednesday of each month. This is an opportunity for you regardless of your skill level, your subject matter, 
your gender to grab a seat, tune other things out, right? In a casual environment that leaves breathing room for you to get inspired. Get back to that rough draft and back to the final draft, get unstuck. You might even quickly kick some ideas around with fellow writers. I don't like sharing my ideas. But if you do, you should definitely go. You want to get settled in by 7 p.m. Bring your materials, grab a drink, a cheese platter, and a table. We'll get started with prompt for those who like one, though there will be no pressure to do anything with it. Most of the evenings will be yours to quietly write. Those of us at the hook need that. I imagine you do too. We'll, we'll spend the last 20 minutes or so sharing some of your work only if you'd like. Come over and write with us. We'll see you there. Right hook. Hashtag right hook. Hashtag second Wednesday. So that is going on second Wednesday of every month now at Ramsey's in Marion. By the way, Ramsey carries my favorite wine. It is a Moscato from Australia. Oh my god. Uh. I haven't had that wine in like two years. I need to go get some. It is my favorite wine. It's delicious. Their cheese platters, meat platters are amazing. Ramsey's is just like the bomb to go. So we have all that going on. Uh, and like I said, I'd like to start doing a five minute to a minute to five minute clip every day, possibly, uh, called Whiskey and Teacup. And uh, we're going to be changing this up. So this is my first rough draft of this and getting it organized and settled and uh yeah so we'll see how this goes all right everybody thank you so much for watching i hope that you had a wonderful time and in the words of mr charlie go packers and f bears i hope you have a wonderful day and keep smiling you're king you're queen you're part of the royal court i welcome you with lots of love this big hug from my home to yours don't be an asshole and don't be a mass murderer all right guys have a great day i will see you next time here on queen acacia channel Bye! Uh, did not meet... So many stutters there. Uh... Facebook keeps updating and changing and it is hard to keep track of everything. Please stop! Yeah, I got nothing. <laughs> da 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 Is that it? No. No. Oh, what's this? Blow dry boot camp. I just got invited to this. I don't even know where it went. I have to edit all this out now. No, I don't want to go to farming. Um, share of blah 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 or share Team Royal